Thanks for tuning in. This is Dr. Lewis, and today what I want to talk to you, talk to you about is spinal arthritis or degeneration. It's a common term I hear all the time, and uh, really what I want to walk you through today is just to shed some light on really what uh, spinal arthritis is and really what causes it. And a lot of people don't really understand that majority of your arthritic change and spinal arthritis that is developed in your body um, is actually from uh, mechanical related issues. Um, primarily from misalignment in the spine. You know, I hear um, patients being told all the time by other doctors that it's just, quote, normal aging. And uh, that would be right. There are some forms of normal aging. Um, but when we look into the spine um, and we look at the disc, primarily what I have here. So when we look in the spine, primarily you have these vertebrae. And in between each one of these vertebrae, you actually have a disc. And these discs, are primarily cushions for the vertebrae and in between the vertebrae you have your nerve roots and these nerve roots that's how the messages from your brain come down your spinal cord out to your nerves and that's how they feed into your muscles so you can move them it is also what feeds into your organs so that it can tell them how to work for example um, to tell your heart how to beat and so at the end of the day your spine's sole purpose protect the nerves and uh, in between these vertebrae in your spine are actually cushioned by disc and there is a normal aging that so uh, there's one thing that affects this also universal law it's called gravity so we're always being compressed and gravity what that does to your body is it does cause normal aging in the disc but when I look at an x-ray and I look at x-rays all the time in my clinic and uh, I'll commonly see a healthy disc and then below that I'll see a disc that's nearly completely gone well, that is not considered normal aging. That is actually from mechanical related issues. So the, one of the most common causes of spinal degeneration and or spinal arthritis is that your spine will suddenly shift and misalign out of its normal position. Now, uh, a car accident can uh, cause this, sports injuries can cause this, and also very repetitive types of injuries, um, spinal what we call traumas or injuries, micro traumas, which would be more if you're, say, a grocery bagger and you're always using one side of the body. Um, if you're always carrying your purse on one side, you're uh, going to cause these micro traumas to the spine. But at the end of the day, when you do that, it's just like driving a car that's misaligned. And you know how if you drive a car that's misaligned, those tires, in this case your disc, will start to wear out faster. So, you know, normally if you're supposed to have 60,000 miles on those tires, instead of when you drive a misaligned car, those tires you're only going to get 20,000 miles out of them and the same applies to here to your spine so when it shifts out of its position that you can see here that disc becomes compressed on this side so just like driving a misaligned car it causes those discs to um, wear out it's called aberrant motion and it causes it to break down and why that's important and causes a lot of people's pain is because now that spinal arthritis starts to build so your body will start to build deposits in here and it causes it to become rigid if you will and and then long term it can cause pinching or impingement of those nerves that can feed and lead into a lot of your health related issues and so at the end of the day the number one really step to stopping that process and is really the primary focus of a chiropractor is to locate that misalignment and to actually restore that normal position and by restoring that normal position we can stop or slow that degeneration going on in the spine. Now I've personally seen through proper rehabilitation in certain types of uh, repetitive mechanical traction, sometimes the disc will even start to rehydrate. Uh, but really the number one priority when it comes to um, arthritic change and spinal degeneration, the number one thing is you want to stop it from progressing. So when you have one disc that's worn out and all the rest are healthy, um, most of the time it's from uh, as a result of the spine being out of its normal position and so you know when we look in, into the body there are certain ways that you can look at to identify if you do have a misaligned spine so you know as a chiropractor one of our primary tools that we do is we look at your posture so when we look at the posture from front to back our shoulders and if you see any type of high shoulder like that that's an indicator that you could have some form of misalignment there going on in your spine 
We also use digital range of motion. So when we do have a misalignment in the spine, when you try to bend, you have a decreased range of motion versus when it's normal, the spine will no move in its normal position. Um, the final test um, that we uh, tend to use in our office uh, when medically necessary is we can confirm the misalignment with an x-ray. And so if you're suffering from any spinal arthritis degeneration or back related issues and have never considered a chiropractor, um, give us a call. Uh, you can give us a call at 512-297-2288 and you can ask us about our new patient special offer where we uh, will come in, do a detailed exam consultation to identify the cause um, of your health concerns and more importantly help you um, uh, to develop a plan to restore. So it's Dr. Lewis, stay tuned and look forward to meeting you and seeing you at our next episode.